Well, Tempus Fugit, I think it's about uh, life and death, as, uh, as corny as it sounds. Uh, it's uh, the Chacon from Bach. It was written uh, after his wife passed away. And, you know, musicians, they think that it was dedicated to her and to them and to their life and, and her death. It's a recreation of a piece that was done, I think, about 10 years ago at this point. The piece follows fragments of couples and relationships and friendships. It's about just as much uh, celebration of love or of a life, trying to squeeze as much as you can out of it, and then also coming to, to some form of end. The last time we did the run through, I, I felt like I was reflecting about time a lot. You know, we have a lot of like run-ins uh, on stage, you know, and I was like connecting to this, like we cannot stop time, you no, know? we have this force that is always making us like run or move or dance, you no, know? and how we cannot avoid it. I chose the Chacon and Bach because it's a, it's a piece, especially the Chacon is a piece of music that I have been listening to for many, many years and I thought it would be a, a, a challenge. The dancers have been fantastic. I, I really adore them. They're extremely talented, uh, passionate, uh, intelligent. Uh, no, it's, it's, an, it's really a pleasure to be here and to work with them.